What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Zell and welcome back to Get Right or Get Wrong. I want to talk about a funny ass subject today. <clears throat> I don't know if you follow me on Instagram, but I'm about to break, break down pretty much the metaphor I said. Now, let's say Amazon is a big ass box of donuts. I'm talking about huge. These donuts are everywhere. Hop in the comments too to answer this question. So you got a big ass box of donuts. You open them up, aka get higher. <clears throat> and wow, there's a lot of donuts in here. Are you gonna pick a donut that's fresh and you know for a fact nobody touched it and not, none of that shit? It's a whole donut fresh and all that shit. Or would you go to a donut that got bite marks in it? Somebody that did this to it, took a sprinkle or two off, scraped some of the frosting off, and all that shit. Like I want that donut. No, I want that donut. The donut is like, it's tainted. It got a lot of shit going on with it. Or, that's what I'm saying. Would you pick the, the donut that didn't have nothing going on with it? Or would you get the one that's been touched and all types of shit? So, the metaphor, I'm pretty much saying it's the people in there. It is too many donuts in there. Too many people for you to be getting a person that done fucked multiple people in there. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> and there's a lot of uh, red pill talk that be on YouTube about how women want the man that got a lot of women. Crazy logic to me because it's, at the same time, they get pissed when they hear they got cheated on or get pissed when they see that man talking to another woman. So you have to make that shit make sense. I want a dude that got all the holes on them that, that got... That got People waiting in line for him. I want that dude, but I don't want him to cheat on me, and I don't want him to talk to other chicks. That logically does not make sense, ladies. You know what I'm saying? And you niggas. You niggas be doing that shit, too. You know what I'm saying? I ain't going to just poke, poke at the ladies. I'm not going to do that. You know what I'm saying? I've been working there about two years. So I've seen this shit in vendor returns. I done seen this shit in ship dock. I done seen it down there in trans. I done seen it in AFE1 and now AFE2. It's like literally six donuts that the girls like to grab in that box, aka six six dudes, just smashing all of them. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Meanwhile, there are hundreds of donuts in that motherfucking spot that they could have picked. So, hey, me, I've never been a hating a hating nigga. I salute those dudes. They are doing what the fuck they're supposed to do. There's a lot of drama going on around that building. Over these donuts that people then broke off and took a bite of and put in there, and they thought the girl, the girl thought that oh, I'm gonna keep this donut to myself. Like, no, somebody else wanna take a bite of that donut. Meanwhile, you keep ignoring the donuts that's over there that ain't been touched, none of that. You know what I'm saying? They just in the box, like, hey, eat me. But you know, and everybody was like, how is that happening? And a lot of people was like, well, maybe the other dudes ain't shooting their shots. Maybe not. Maybe some dude don't. Maybe some dudes don't know how to talk to women. Maybe they don't know how to approach them. You don't know. But I do know this. Interaction works both ways. I never understood y'all women's logic like I can't approach a man. No, you can. I, I figured out that, that secret about it because women, women don't want to be rejected. That's why they won't approach no dude. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? They don't, that's that's going to mess with their self-esteem and their ego. Excuse me. Hold on. Let me go get my drink. I'm about to get this thing, man. So it's like when I move, it's gonna move with me. So I can't wait till I get that shit. So it, it'll kind of be dope. Even though I don't need y'all to follow me everywhere I go, but you know, still. But yeah, that's why a lot of women don't approach men. But you would be surprised how much potential y'all missing out on. You know what I'm saying? That dude could probably be the love of your life, but you didn't approach him because maybe he lacked the skills to talk to a woman. And that dude could be dope as fuck. But you missed out because you got the same six donuts and you know goddamn well people done bit off that donut, that dude. You know he done fucked all these chicks in here. So you knew eight chicks ago he was fucking them and you still, he came to you with the same game. <clears throat> you like, well, okay. Uh. And then when you see, and then when he go ahead and put, you know, his hand in that hole. That's a bad metaphor. Well, donut is a hole. Once he... 
I'm trying to be careful with my words on YouTube. Once he, once he, once he go ahead and get done with you, you know what I'm saying, with the adult shit. Now he's on to the next one. Why are you, why are you acting shocked after he does that with you when you see him do that already? That's my whole thing. Like I said, I don't know what they're saying or paying, but it's working. I salute those dudes. I'm never, I'm never no, I'm, I'm never gonna hate on no nigga. They doing what they supposed to do. So these women that are playing tug of war with a penis, y'all are the real goof troops. Y'all are the real silly bellies. There are too many men in there for that shit. Same with you dudes. I don't know. I seen a few, few dudes fighting over a chick. I'm like, are you serious? You, you fighting over her? Do you not see these other motherfuckers over here? For real? Hundreds of them in there. I'm telling you, I don't mean, that's just me, man. I, I can't speak on nobody else. I do not want a chick that everybody done fucked on. I'm sorry, whether it's a relationship or on, on some common sex or friendly fuck buddy shit. Nah, I'm all right. I was always attracted to the chick that the dudes could not fuck. <clears throat> That's the ones I always like. That's the ones that always caught my eye. You feel what I'm saying? But for some reason, everybody want to bang the same people. It reminds me of those rappers, too. It's like, bruh. There are too many IG whores that's ready for you to just go ahead and damn near get them pregnant. Salute to Drake. But um, it's so many IG whores on here, but y'all were all fucking the same chick. I think her name was Selena Powell or something like that. There is no reason all those dudes should have fucked that one chick. One chick. So this is what I'm saying. You niggas is weirdos too. Weird as fuck. Y'all females is weird. It's too many niggas in there for y'all to be dick pulling the same dude. And then get mad when he do what he was supposed to be doing. And, and doing what he did before, and that you noticed. You seen that shit. You seen it. I seen a motherfucker bite that donut and put it back in the box. But I want to bite that same donut. You going to keep ignoring the other motherfuckers that's, that's, that, that, that the donuts in there? The other men? He ain't got dreads. He ain't dark. No big ass beard. I don't understand that shit. Like, I don't, I, <clears throat> I just don't understand that logic. So my whole thing is keep doing what y'all doing. If that's what, you know, what floats your boat, go ahead. My whole thing is you shouldn't be crying in there. You shouldn't be about to risk your job <clears throat> and none of that shit. You knew what it was. You knew what it was with this dude. Same with y'all dudes. Y'all, 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 y'all know. Y'all know this chick get around. You know, she got her OnlyFans. She, she's she really, very friendly with, you know, her gift. She, you know, she's friendly. Hey, uh, as long as you, you, you talking the right good shit and you paying the right amount, you can get a piece of this cookie too. You know that. And then you getting your feelings to get mad when the next dude was shit. All you had to do was pay. Well, I got some money too. Hold on, man. What the fuck? No, man. No, no, we ain't doing that. What you mean we ain't doing that? What, what, what you mean, bro? You know what I'm saying? The price is right. She about to give she about to give him a night. The price is right, she about to give him a night, they about to take flight. It is what it is. You gotta stay out your feelings about that shit. And that's another thing too I've been noticing at that job. Damn this lemonade sour. That's another thing I noticed. You dudes a cuff a chick that look good and have like a a, a big ass or whatever. And get upset when other dudes look at her and, you know, all that shit. You have to be the biggest simp <clears throat> in the world. I don't give a fuck. Ain't about no, I'm protecting my woman. No, 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 bro. That's not how that works. You're supposed to be playing about this shit. Like, I don't give a fuck how these niggas be looking at my girl or whatever because I'm going home with her. You about to risk your job, too, for getting mad at niggas looking at your girl. She looks good. Salute, sir. You knew what was coming with that. Yo, it was a rapper that just killed himself, too. I don't know his name. Y'all can look him up. It's a rapper that killed an IG model. She was fucking gorgeous, but, she, of course, she was an IG hoe. You know what I'm saying? Worked at a strip club, had her OnlyFans and all this shit. This dude falls in love with her. And I guess dudes be getting mad because they can't change somebody for being a hoe. Like, you met her as a hoe. Sweetheart, you met this dude as the dude that's in here fucking everything. Why are you getting mad for them being who they are? You understood that. You seen it. Ain't nobody know what I didn't know. That's bullshit. Some of this shit is just blatantly out there. 
I know so much shit I'm not supposed to know. Why? Because motherfuckers are Pac-Man and Mrs. Pac-Man at Amazon. Talk, 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 talk. Like, shut the fuck up. Like, I don't even be asking some of these shits. Or you packing next to some people and they talking louder than they think. Like, yo, I heard everything that just happened over there. But me, I don't really go around doing that messy ass shit going, well, I heard, well, I heard. I don't really, that, that, ain't, that ain't really my style. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, I don't know. I don't know when you're going to clean this up. Not that, This is not just the Amazon matter. This is an everyday life matter. Like, people are no... This chick is a hoe and think that they about to change them. Like, they're going to keep them to themselves. Like, that's not how that works. You know, same with females. Oh, I can change him. No, that is a dog. He's humping everything around there. He's going to hump that chair. He's going to hump that chair. He's going to hump that light. He's going to hump that TV. That's what he does. You know what I'm saying? I'm a dog. I'm a dog. You know what I'm saying? And your bitch going to be a bitch. She a, she a dog in heat. Fellas, you got to let them be, get your turn. That's what I'm going to say. These chicks and nobody, these chicks and these niggas are not yours. <clears throat> it's just your turn. <laughs> Shout out to Earthquake. Shout out to millions of players that said that shit. It's never your girl. It's never your nigga. It's just your turn. That's all it is. Keep your motherfucking feelings in your pocket. For real. Get your turn. Shut the door. Keep it moving. You know what I'm saying? Because it's getting, it's, it's getting crazy, man. More and more I see on YouTube all these questions. Ladies, would you date a bisexual man? A lot of y'all are doing that right now and don't even know. I tell you, let me, let me, let me let y'all in a secret. If it's a dude that got a high ass sex drive, that that something you you know, you should watch out for that. If a dude is willing to pay you out of desperation because he wants to hit that bad, he got sexual drive, you don't think he would go mess with a dude? Like I said, these motherfuckers are serial humpers. They gotta hump something. They gotta hump something. I haven't heard. You know what? Let me shut the fuck up on that one. You shut the fuck up on that one. I heard some horror stories up in Amazon. You know what I'm saying? A lot of these chicks mess with these dudes that mess with dudes. It is what it is. But all I can do is tell y'all to be careful, move a little smart in there. We all adults. We all responsible. Hopefully, y'all are using protection and all that good shit. You know, I don't know, but. You know, a lot of people have asked me about that Amazon atmosphere. I'm like, it is a big, big high school orgy. None of those dudes or chicks belong to y'all. Y'all belong to everybody in that bitch. But except those little donuts that y'all not touching for some reason, maybe if you start talking to some shit that hasn't been touched or broke off, you'll have a little bit, you know, you'll have some different results. You won't be caught up in that one tornado like, ah! Man, that's my bitch. That's my bitch. No, man, that's my bitch. Like, hey, bro, it's a lot of females in there. It, chicks, it's a lot of dudes in there. Move around. Change your type. Expand your horizons. You know what I'm saying? Like, get that one image of what you want out of a person. Like, you know, it's okay. Me, I've always been colorblind. Chinese, Puerto Rican, black, white, whatever. My quote is, no race is safe. If I find you attractive, I like your vibe. I'm on your ass, just like those panties, baby. That's what it's gonna be. So I, I ain't about no. I like them light skin. Oh, I like them dark skin. Oh, I like this race. No, 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 no. No race is safe. I'm a guy. I like women. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Ain't about no. I gotta chase this type. That's what y'all women is on. So thus, this man out here is living the dream. He doing his thing. I salute him. There was a coworker that said some shit, and she said it so gangster and confident, like. I was like shocked that she said it with such swag. She said, yeah, y'all niggas ain't nothing but hoes either. Y'all just hoes too. We just pass y'all around. I'm like, are you saying that like in an assaulting way? Come on, fellas, hop in the comments. Would you get mad if you just banged a girl? And she's like, nigga, get up out of here. Go fuck my friend. Okay, I feel dirty. Yeah, yeah. Go fuck my cousin next. No, niggas is like, what? It's lit. So, I just fucked you. I can fuck your best friend, too. I can fuck your other friend. I can fuck your cousin. You gotta fuck your sister, too. That's not a fucking insult. Dudes love that shit. What do you mean you passing these dudes around? That's not, that's, a, that's not an insult to a nigga. Niggas love that shit. Like, hell, yeah, I'm the man up in this bitch. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, salute to my cousin. I used to work at Walmart. Nigga ran through the building. 
One man ran through the building. All them other dudes in there. But they want that dude. The women be wanting the nigga that done fucked everybody in there, but get upset. You should not be getting upset. Get your turn and keep it moving. Shut the fuck up. You want to see what all the hype was about? Some of you chicks talk too much. Oh, he fucked the shit out of me. Shut up. Shut the, just shut the fuck. Stop talking. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Same with y'all dudes, man. She, man, man, she trying to eat my dick off. Shut up. If you really trying to keep it to yourself, don't give dudes motivation. Like, she did what? She did what? She gagged you. Nigga, I got to see what's up with that. And that's how that shit started happening, man. But uh, like I said, this video was most definitely overdue. Because Sharon is Karen. That's what I'm going to name <laughs> the title of this video. It's going to be Sharon is Karen. Because motherfuckers are definitely sharing. And it's getting bad. You know, it started fights. It's starting a lot of drama in there. When it really doesn't have to be that way. Because there's too many people in there for that. It's too many options. Too many. So, I mean, like I said, but some people like drama. Some people is into that toxic shit. They, they, they into that. They like that. Let me go take this bitch nigga because, you know, she thinks she got him on lock. But I'm going to show him. I Show her I can take him from him. Same with dude. They like, man, I take this nigga bitch. When you really don't have to do that. That's kind of like just pointless. Like, it's too many motherfuckers around. But, um... <laughs> Like, definitely like and subscribe. Share it if you want to. And um, hit the comments. If you know other Amazonians, pass this video around. I, I, I guarantee you somebody's going to be in the comments like, that motherfucker's not lying. It is like literally probably seven or six to seven dudes fucking one whole department. It, it, and it's hella dudes in there. Same with, same with chicks. Everybody's running through this chick in that one department. Tell me I'm lying. Tell me I'm lying, man. I see it with my own eyes. Me, I'm the nigga with the popcorn in my drink. Let me see what the fuck that's going to happen. Somebody going to end up fighting. This going to be some shit eventually. This shit going to get caught up. You know, it's going to get uncomfortable. That's what I mean, y'all. Get right or get wrong. Get right. Explore your options. There are too many people out here for you to be banging on the same person, man. Seriously. Stop being fucking shallow, you know? You know I mean? You can be shallow to a certain extent, I guess. But I'm talking about not to the point that you are fucking dipping your cookie in some milk that a whole bunch of people milk been in a mouth and teeth been on. Ooh, I want me a new cup of milk. I don't want to dip that. Ooh, no. Gross. What the fuck? Give me another cup, bro. You know what I'm saying? Get right. Get another cup of fucking milk. Get a fresh cup. Now, I already know some of you people are going to say, well, nobody beats going to be a virgin. That's not the fucking point. I'm talking about in an area. If you had a goddamn known bar and you've known this person to get getting smashed on doing all this, don't talk to that fucking person in the bar. At Amazon, at a skating ring, if you go skating, you know this motherfucker right here that fucked everybody in there. You probably want to avoid that person. Probably go somewhere else because that's drama. He got, he got it. She and he got a lot of shit going on with them. You know what I'm saying? Everybody want them. Let the best person win. That's like throwing a bone. And then everybody's a dog. He's one bone. They're going to kill each other over that, over that bone. Get wrong. Keep moving the way you're moving. Lose your job. <laughs> Lose everything because your motherfucking, your hormones. You, you, you want to be territorial. You want to try to change somebody that, that don't want to be changed. Like I said, like, share, subscribe. Make sure you go to Shades by DMH. I said DMS because my stupid ass, I got a tattoo that say DMS. For me, my mom, and my sister, I got all of our initials in here. But it's shades by DMH.com. So get on there, get your shades. You got some over here. Tomorrow, I'll probably get two more pair because tomorrow's payday. So I'm going to go ahead and play a little bit with my money and shop with my um, my auntie and shit. But um, I'll catch y'all tomorrow. God bless. <sighs> stay, oh <clears throat> shit, stay dangerous and wear masks. My bad. Just got done eating that Wendy's, y'all. My stomach is like, whoo.